It's Miss Murray again. We're going to do part two of creating our iMovie commercial for the third grade students coming up into fourth grade next year. So of course I'm going to start by clicking on iMovie in my dock and letting it load up. Remember I'm putting my patient pants on, letting it load up. And usually iMovie is really good about remembering right where you left off. So you might notice that this is the same screen um, that, that came up at the end of the last lesson. Alright, so the next part that I'm going to show is the storyboard. Okay, and you'll notice on the storyboard, if you'll just take a second and you'll scroll down, there are pictures and there are words. So I'm going to scroll down, I'm just going to show you all of these. until the end of the movie and again it depends on what trailer you trailer you pick as to how many words you have what words you have etc etc so I'm gonna go back to some of my other projects and I'm gonna bring up the movie that I made uh, the commercial I made for you guys and I'm gonna open that one up and you'll notice I'm on my storyboard, which is the middle tab here. So I just click right there to go to story storyboard. And I changed all of these words. So if you want to change the words, all you have to do is click in the box. It automatically highlights the text for you. So you can just hit the delete key and it will get rid of all of the text. And then you can type in. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna type in I want to keep my text. <clears throat> Okay, so I've got my really old fourth grader films, and then I've changed all the text here in between third and fourth grades. And you'll want to notice, um, I most of the time I do not have a complete sentence, which is very different when you're um, writing things on a piece of paper. When you're doing a movie, you're going to use short words and phrases that build on each other. So you'll notice I have a phrase right here, in between third. And then on my next line, I have and fourth grades. There is one path to take, journey to the fourth grade hallway. So I don't want my uh, text to be too long because it's not on the screen for very long. And I have to make sure that my audience that watches the film is going to be able to read it in the time that it's on the screen. Okay, so... I can kind of go slow right here and show you. Okay, journey to the fourth grade hallway. So I'm going super slow, super slow. All right, um, I have changed all my text and I have added pictures and videos in here to create my storyboard. What I would like for you to work on today is just to work on your text. What is the story that you want to tell to the third graders to help them get ready for fourth grade. So think about that, talk about it with your group, and work on filling out your storyboard.